Let's go through how to edit, upload and create documents within Teams. All documents created within a team end up in a SharePoint site within Microsoft 365. Teams is a piece of software to make navigating these documents simple. Let's head into our test team, the general channel and into the files tab at the top. Within here you can see we have our existing test document. We can click the three dots and choose whether we want to open this file within Teams in the Word application itself or in a web browser. You can also copy a link to the item to send to a colleague. This is available to link them into the Teams application or into SharePoint. These will only work internally. To create new files, you can select the new drop down menu at the top of the screen where you'll be able to create folders or documents depending on your needs. You can also use the upload drop down to transfer files or folders into the channel. A little tip is that you can also drag and drop files from your computer into the main section. This will also upload them into the channel. To share a file externally, you will have to hit the open in SharePoint option. This will then bring you into a web version showing your files. You can then click the share option. Bearing in mind, if no files are selected, it will share the whole folder. You can then select the drop down and select specific people to share your files with. We would never normally advise to create a link with anyone unless it is a public facing document. This will then ask for the email address of the individual you'd like to share it with securely. You'll then be able to write a message and send the email directly from the browser or you can create a hyperlink which can be copied into an email. When sharing an individual file you will get more options such as opening in a reviewer mode only or blocking the download of the file.